let's get it started. Purple Haze. All right, these robots are out of the gate. Purple Haze looking to try and crush down on Andrew's tiny top. Andrew trying to get that lifter in and flip over Purple Haze. Uh, and hopefully, oh, there's a clamp down on Purple Haze. Yeah. Is he going through? He's crushing. He's crushing into that frame, looking for some juicy goodness. A speed controller, a battery, who knows? Purple Haze will have to let go at some point here. We'll give him a count. I'll have to release the hold in five, four, three. You must release Purple Haze. You can't control the entire time. Are they stuck? Okay. Oh, he's lifting them up. <laughs> okay. We'll let him go. Do you want to shake him off? We can unstick him. All right, let's pause the match. We'll unstick these robots. Now, you're allowed to clamp down your robot. That's fine and dandy. You just can't hold on to the entire fight. It's like being in the corner of the boxing ring and just keeping your, your opponent in the corner. You must let go. You must come back. So we'll unstick the robots. Purple Haze can keep on crushing at any point during the match. It's just that they get stuck together. We must separate them to make it a fair fight. All right, we'll separate them. And we'll restart the match in three, two, one, and start. We got about a minute to go in the match. Purple Haze looking to clamp down again to see if there's any damage to Andrew yet. Doesn't look like it from a first glance. But who knows, clamping down the robots always leads to trouble. <laughs> Purple Haze looking for another clamp. Looks like the beat may be stuck. Both robots jockeying for position still. It's anybody's ball game. We're under 20 seconds to go in this fight. Uh, uh. Still both robots jockeying for position. Yeah! Right now Purple Haze going down again. Looks like he got the other side this time clamped down. Four, three, two, yeah. one. And this fight will go to the judges. Another tough fight to call.